Desencana, só rolê bom Ela chega e desencana Com o passo bem sou Passo bem sou Passo bem sou Na festa do fim de semana So, welcome to the channel, guys. Do you like my intro? First, we need to download Reshade from its official website. From here, download any version you like. It is not gonna matter. I already have this, so I just gonna cancel it. Then go to that folder in which you downloaded it. But before that, there is something we need to set in our emulator. For that, click on Emulation tab and go to config. After that, go to graphics window by clicking here and set API to Vulkan. We set it to Vulkan because it is best for switch emulation. Then open the setup of Reshade, which you downloaded. It will show a warning message, just click OK. Then from here, select your emulators.exe file. Now click Next and select Vulkan. It will show a make changes in device warning message, just allow it. Then it will ask you for downloading its effects and add-ons. We do not need any of them, so we will just click next and finish our installation. Then we need to change some settings to run the Citroen even better. First, in window tab, search graphic settings and simply click it. From here, add your emulator's .exe file. Then click on its options and set it performance to high. After that, go to the gaming window and off the game bar and gaming mode. Then just close the settings and open your emulator. After it start running, open your Task Master from Windows tab or by pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus Exit. Go to its Detail tab and search you Emulator's app icon. Then right-click it and set its priority to high. You have to done this step every time you open the emulator. Now only two steps remains. So go to the Emulation tab from there to Config and Open System window. From here, press on Applets tab and set the keyboard applet to custom. By doing this step, you will not get over screen keyboard crash, which you usually get whenever you try to type something in the game. Now you just need to start your game and let it load. Now you will see a window above, which indicates that you successfully installed the reshade. Click on Home button, which is the number 7 on the right had side numbers set to open the Reshade menu tab. Click on Skip Tutorial. Now you will see different effects available in Reshade. If any of them are ticked, just untick them because these will slow down your game. And when you will look down, you will see a Performance Mode option. Click on it and enable it like I am doing. Then save your Reshade settings from here and press Home button again to close your Reshade menu. Now we are into the game and you will surely notice the performance boost and stability and for your notice, I am right now using a 60 frames per second mod on which I made a tutorial on how to install it. You can also use it by watching that video. I will give you a link for that in description or you can just check out my channel. So only this much was in today's video. I hope that you will also enjoy your game in 30 to 60 frames per second like me even on your low end device. If this video helped Please like this video and subscribe my channel for more of these amazing contents. So see ya in next video, bye.